In this video, we're going to go ahead and install Mineral Ray for Maya so we can use it whenever we go through our baking process in the next video. So let's go ahead and make sure that we click File and Save our current scene. So I'm going to click File, Save Scene As, Video 5. All right, I'm just going to save mine to the desktop and select Video 5 and click Save As, say Yes. And then go ahead and click continue. It's saying a student version file. The student version of Maya is only for personal learning. You can't sell assets developed in student versions. I have a professional version that I use in my professional field. However, when I make tutorials, I use the student version just so I'm on the same page as everyone watching the videos because typically people have student versions. If you see this, just go ahead and click continue. It's no big deal. Go ahead and just turn off Maya. So I'll just click file and I'll just click exit and click don't save and it's just going to shut down my end. take us to our desktop now go ahead and open up your browser and below the video which your browser is probably already open because you're watching a video below the video in the description you'll see a link to the mental ray plugin for maya all right what you're looking for is well there's three of them you got linux windows and mac chances are you're looking for the windows go ahead and select that after going to the link and save the file and then after it downloads you want to drop this down go ahead and click this and go ahead and click run and norton says this is safe of course it is <laughs> now you can go ahead and say extract two now i'm going to click cancel because i already have this installed but go ahead and install this you select the destination folder this can be anywhere it does not have to be your autodesk folder but i recommend putting it in your autodesk installation folder it doesn't have to be in the maya folder it just has to be in the autodesk folder just stick it in the autodesk folder and remember where you put it okay so now i'm just going to click cancel because i already have it installed and let's go ahead and boot maya back up all right let's go ahead and click on autodesk maya 2016 and once you have maya back loaded up what we have to do is set up the plugin manager to actually access mineral ray from maya so go ahead and click windows settings preferences and you're looking for plugin manager go ahead and select that now i want you to scroll down until you find maya t-o-m-r okay this is the mineral ray from maya plugin you're looking for maya t-o-m-r and when you see that check loaded and check auto load if you don't see this, you have to go find it. Now, remember the directory that you installed, the Mineral Ray plugin for Maya 2016? You have to go get it. So to find it, you would click Browse. In my case, it was installed in Autodesk, Mineral Ray plugin for Maya 2016, Plugins folder. So that's where I browse to. So wherever you installed Mineral Ray for Maya, you have to go there. So I would go to that drive. I would change this up. I'd go up, up. In my case, I put it in the Autodesk folder. I would find my Mineral Ray plugin for Maya 2016. Double click that. Then you want to go ahead and find it. It says it's in the plugins folder. So that right there is what you got to click. So after you find it, and in my case, it was in where I installed the Mineral Ray plugin was Autodesk Mineral Ray plugin for Maya 2016 plugins. And I found the Maya T-O-M-R dot M-L-L. And I went ahead and clicked and just click open at that point. So in your load plugin, click open, which I'm going to hit cancel because I already have it loaded. And then now it should show up, or if it doesn't, click refresh, and then it'll show up. And then come over and check loaded and auto load. And then you go ahead and close this. It should be installed at that point. So come up here just to see if it is. And in mesh display, drop this down. And now you should see in the vertex bake sets, you should see batch bake mineral rate. If you see this, it's installed. You now have Mineral Ray for Maya installed. If you don't see this, try to shut down your Maya and restart your Maya and then check Mesh Display and see if Batch Bake Mineral Ray is there. If it's not, then you did something wrong. <laughs> I don't know. Comment below the video. I'll try to help you if I can. So in the next video, we'll go ahead and get started with baking out our normal and ambient occlusion from our high poly sculpt. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to post below the video. And click subscribe to follow us on YouTube.